The Jasme cryptocurrency has been added to Coinbase about a week ago. Um, then I did an analysis on it and since then the price has moved up by quite a bit, I think more than 100% and now price is dropping down a little bit more. So I think right now opportunities are arising for nice buys and I have sketched out a few scenarios of what could happen with the price in the upcoming days and weeks um, and also how you could profit off of those scenarios. Alright, let's get right into this price prediction and price analysis of the Jasmine cryptocurrency. Um, fundamentally, I'm not going to say too much about this cryptocurrency. Last time I expressed some of my doubts about its market cap. Um, and I'm, I still don't... Uh, I don't know if it's updated since then. Not on coin, coin market cap, maybe on Coinbase. I didn't check. Um, but yeah, there's still some uh, some things that are not too clear about it. It's a Japanese cryptocurrency and I mean there might be some communication difficulties so that could be it or some some other things could be going on. I'm not quite sure. Um, at least while that has all been going on, the price has rocketed up and is now in a small small downtrend. It might be a small uh, flag. Um, and yeah, I think right now there are some good opportunities. Price is dropping quite a bit right now, so I'm going to try to do this price prediction as soon as possible so uh, you can watch it as quickly as possible and make your trade decisions accordingly. Although you should note that this is just my opinion uh, based on technical analysis. So fundamental news, something about the market cap being way lower or way higher could um, definitely uh, destroy this whole technical analysis altogether. Uh, yeah, look, let's look at it. So price right now is at the 0.066. I think the price could drop down uh, by a little bit more. And I think the first support I think it could find is at, is at this, this, this trend line uh, together with the key level. The key level is 0 0.064 up until 0 0.062. And I think it either will bounce off of that key level and then try to start up a small uptrend again or um, at least a small uptrend and then maybe a consolidation somewhere higher up but that needs to be addressed in an update um, I definitely think that this uh, support trend line will hold so something like this could happen a bounce off of the 0.063 um, after which a break retest of the 0.007 uh, could happen and then maybe one or two more uh, bounces off of the tr uh, support trend line both at different price points I cannot name those price points because it definitely uh, depends on when it will hit it um, also making higher highs so the next possible resistance will be around the 0 0.072 maybe 0 0.074 uh, and from there as I said I think a new uptrend can be started uh, possibly an uptrend into a consolidation a little bit higher possibly between the 0.073 um, and the 0 0.086 um, but as i said earlier as well that really needs to be addressed in an update because we first need to see this uh, support trend line being held um, also in this scenario it could also happen that it doesn't find support immediately at 0.063 um, it might also happen that the price or I think the wick of candlestick might actually shoot down to 0 0.006 or possibly 0 0.059 somewhere around that area um, and that from there on out it bounces up again maybe finding a, break, a small break retest at the support trend line uh, somewhere around 0 0.064 0 0.062 um, but then going above the trend line again I think because this is quite a strong support level the 0 0.006 uh, and when it gets above it, the same uh, applies. I think it uh, will have one or two bounces off of it, then go into a small uptrend and find consolidation and accumulation a little bit higher. Uh, what could also happen, but while I'm recording this video, that seems uh, less, li less and less likely, is that the price from here on out, so from here on out, it, that it will bounce up, not immediately, but possibly with a small or with small steps, so a small uptrend up, and that it will first find resistance at the trend line um, and that really depends on what price level it hits the trend line um, of where it finds resistance 
Um, it could also find resistance at the 0 0.075, 0 0.074 key level. It broke through that, um, but it could definitely retest as a resistance, um, after which the price, I think, can go up again. Like, I think the, the next resistance is 0 0.082. Um, and then the same, I think, will happen as with the first scenario after the small uptrend, basically that it will accumulate a little bit more um, and basically set itself up for, an, uh, for a new uptrend with, um, with some very big moves up. Because after all, this is a, a Coinbase crypto right now and Coinbase isn't a small company and most cryptos on their platform actually uh, perform quite well. So I do not suspect that this cryptocurrency is going to fall. I mean, the least it will do is accumulate and then afterwards it will find uh, an uptrend. And I mean, most uptrends in cryptocurrency happen with very big moves in the beginning. Um, and because it is a crypto on Coinbase, also that's the main reason why I do not think it will uh, drop below the 0 0.06 uh, or the 0 0.0. Uh, five seven. So if you do not care about FOMO, if you are not quite sure about this this coin just yet, in my opinion, but still that is my this is not financial advice. This is just my opinion. I do not think it will break through this uh, a key level I just talked about. Um, so that might be your safest bet. But it could also happen that it just bounces off of this um, support trend line at around 0 0.063, 0 0.062. And then that the scenario plays out, plays out I just explained. Um, so yeah, that's basically this price prediction and price analysis. I think for the uh, next couple of um, days, I wouldn't say it will last a few weeks. I think for the uh, next couple of days and after that I will probably update it once again. Um, me myself, I will definitely monitor this price closely. I think there are opportunities, but I'm not quite sure about it. So, um, yeah, if you want to stay updated about this uh, this price and its uh, price predictions, uh, subscribe, and you will get a notification when a new update uh, comes and new updates of other price predictions too. Uh, as for now, if you have any questions about this this whole prediction and analysis, please let me know down in the comments. Um, and that was that. Thank you for watching and listening and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.